portfolio update sa amuang Philippine stock market na investments. So guys, gusto na mo ipakita ang amuang mga amuang portfolio specifically sa Philippine market para mag-gets ninyo or makita ninyo what we are investing in. But please disclaimer lang, do not invest because mo ni siya ang among invest. Lahi-lahi ta mga style, lahi-lahi ta mga apit ato ang risk appetite, lahi-lahi po tag objective. So, this is not telling you na mo ni siya inyong paliton, please lang. And para kuan lang ba, kumbaga, we want to be transparent na kami mismo, we are experiencing investing in the stock market and naadya mga panahon na musaka siya and naapod siya panahon na munaog siya. So without further ado, let's get into the screenshot no, of our Philippine stock market. So basically guys, upat ka stocks ang mo ang gi-own. So the first one is ARIT. Sa tanan na mong portfolio, as you can see, is kanilang ang profitable. And this is the first um, REIT sa Pilipinas. And kung mag-invest ka sa REIT, duha ka buhok ang ways na maka-earn ka, pwede ka mo earn pinaagi sa capital gain, and pwede po ka maka-earn og dividendo. The good thing about investing in REITs is that you will be receiving dividends jud because part na sa ilang requirement na mag-release og dividends. Ikaduha is DDMPR, which is katong sa double dragon. And then, as you can see, negative 11.48% pa siya. But we decided to hold this stock and buy more, it's because gusto may sa dividends, mo na siyang reason ano namin palit, and then in the future, pananaw na mo that it's still going to be good. Ikatulo is dito. Diba? So I really don't understand anong ninaog ang dito, pat sukad na pag-launch nila. Pero in the future, I think it's going to be a good hedge because uh, it's going to be a competitor sa Globe, sa PLDT, and kung maka-offer sila og nindot na internet connection as they are promising, then I think it will be a good um, investment for long-term investors. Ay kaupat, rather, is FMETF, which is copies or mimics the performance of the top 30 companies sa Pilipinas. Basically, kung mapalit ka ani na stock, no, it's an index fund, gina, nag-invest na po ka sa Jollibee, sa SM, sa Ayala, sa BDO, sa top 30 companies sa Pilipinas by just owning this one stock. And as of now, negative 5.88% siya, but in the future, the index has proven to go up man sa that's the reason why we are hedging on this. In fact, muna yung pinakadako na mong posisyon. Amo ang brokerage firm na ginagamit is First Metro Securities. Ibutan na mo ang link sa comment section or sa description. Para kung ganahan mo mag-try o invest sa stock market, you can also do it on your own. We are showing you this to prove no, na dili jud ingon na permanente saka ang market. Na ajay mga panahon na munaog siya, na apoy panahon na musaka siya. You have to understand what you're getting yourself into before ka mag-invest. So question of the day lang is this. What do you think is going to happen to the Philippine stock market in general regardless if you're from Luzon, Visayas, or Mindanao? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section. Kay intrigue pud mi kung sa inyong pananaw about it. 